Hey, what's going on guys, my name's Raph, and today, the title for episode 109 of the Pokemon Journeys anime was revealed. We found out that Ash will be battling Raihan in order to enter the Master's 8. There's a bunch of information to cover, so let's jump straight into it. Don't forget to leave this video a like to show support, and I'll be sure to bring out my next video shortly. Make sure to subscribe if you're not ready to keep up to date, and without further ado, let's begin. Before we discuss the title, let's have a brief chat about the build up to this episode. Shout out to my friend Gryphon for sourcing the initial information. During the time of Animag and Animedia revealing title information about upcoming episodes, it seemed that episode 109 was classed as private. Like Gryphon, I too have never seen anything like this before, and the assumption of a break happened to be on the table. But it turns out that we found out that this was a new title, which ended up getting revealed today. Let's now discuss the new title, alongside explore potential theories and plot points. Before I begin, the details I'll be discussing are in no particular order. This is just pure speculation. Episode 109 is titled Versus Raihan, Battle for Masters 8. No summary has been revealed at the current time. The episode will air on the 6th of May. So here we go. We finally now have an indication on how Ash will be elevating into the Masters 8. It seems that from the 25th anniversary special preview trailer, Ash will be travelling to Hammerlock, and of course, situated where the PWC battle may be held. Seeing as we know Greninja will be training Lucario in the episode prior, it makes sense as to why Ash will be potentially using Lucario in this battle. In the Sword and Shield games, the battle against Raihan is a double battle, so it could be the same, or either a 1v1 or 3v3. The battle could either imply that Ash will need to defeat Raihan, an existing member of the Masters 8, to get into the Masters 8 himself. Raihan has either fallen into the Hyper Class due to Flynn, or he is much higher in the Master Class compared to before. Raihan was ranked 7 prior to episode 27, and his new rank is currently unknown. Maybe due to fluctuations, he could be higher than Flynn or lower. I believe that this is where Ash has to defeat a Master 8 opponent in order to get into the Master Class, or Raihan himself is fighting to get back into the Master Class and has to take down Ash in order to get there. In terms of the outcome, I hope Ash loses. I want to see him understand the meaning and power behind the Galar Gym Leaders, just like how he did against B. The Master 8 is the biggest competition on top of the food chain. This isn't going to be easy. June Awada, the director of Pokemon Journey said back in July and September's 2021 Spoon 2D issue that Ash will become more unbeatable as the series goes on. Even though I hope Ash loses to Raihan, I think it's set in stone that he's going to start to sweep and win his way up. The superclass does hold its controversy with battles being skipped off screen, and it almost feels like we're getting the Masters 8 around the corner, but who knows what the outcome will be. The next Masters 8 opponent or contender may most likely get revealed at the end of episode 109, at least that's what I hope for. I guess we'll find out next month. Overall, Pokemon Journeys is piping up with so much heat, it's incredible! Be sure to stay tuned for another video on Friday, in which I'll be covering the episode 108 preview focusing on Gaga. But why not let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. If you guys would like to interact with me, then be sure to follow me on Twitter and join the Team Pokecraft Discord server to discuss all things Pokemon. You can find the rest of my social networks on screen and in the description below. If you enjoyed the video, then be sure to leave it a like as your support is greatly appreciated. Don't forget to share the video with your friends. Finally, make sure to subscribe to keep up to date with my videos and click on the little bell to enable notifications so you guys get notified when I upload a new video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and be sure to stick around for more Pokemon content. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.